7 o'clock is our local talent showcase. Now listen, we have some of the finest singers in the state of Florida right here on stage starting at 7 o'clock as well as the Orange Blossom Opry Band. To get your tickets, you can visit www.obopry.com or call our box yes. office directly at 352-821-1201. I look forward to seeing y'all at the Orange Blossom Opry. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Orange Blossom Opry. At this time, we ask that you please silence all cell phones and pagers. And as you know, flash photography and video recording is not allowed. We also ask that you please remove all caps and hats so the people behind and around you can enjoy the view. Gum chewing is not allowed. And please don't stick it under your seat. We're happy that you've joined us here at the Orange Boss Mopperty and ask that you please take all refuse with you to the nearest exit as you leave the auditorium. And now, ladies and gentlemen, sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. I was born in the Southland. Seven? Seven. Seven. That's better than usual. That's better than usual. 20 some odd years ago. Get him, Doug. Thirteen, fifteen, sixteen. He got a lot more. You're getting a lot better. Huh. <clears throat> I ran away for the first time. <laughs> That's just uncalled for. I ran away for the first time. Yeah! You're busy! <laughs> when I was only four years old, but I'm a big old man. And my home is on. Every inch of highway, every foot of back road, every mile of railroad track. I got a woman in Cincinnati, I got another in San Antonio, but I always loved the girl next door, but I never did stay home, because I'm a freeborn man. And my home is on my back. Every inch of highway, every foot of back road, every mile of railroad track, it's fiddle time.
Hey, I know every inch of highway, every foot of back road, every mile of railroad track. Come on, son, get it done. set goals and my goal is after that that was pretty good though wasn't it I mean can the boys play or what but I'm gonna do something tonight I'm not sure what it is but I'm gonna make you clap I'm not sure what it is yet but I'm gonna get those hands off those knees I promise you I am howdy everybody welcome to the Orange Blossom Opry we are the Orange Blossom Opry band and uh, welcome to what day is it Friday it's Friday I think it is Friday it's Friday welcome to our Friday show and uh, my gosh the uh, Dick Clark uh, explosion, I guess you would call it, is here. Uh, it's a tremendous band. They're huge. Uh, their sound check was great, and I'm excited because um, I was actually on uh, Dick Clark. It was called American Bandstand. I've been on that show a whole bunch of times, so it's kind of cool seeing these guys, and uh, it's going to be a fun night. Uh, but we're going to come out here first, and we're going to play till about 11.30, quarter to 12. <laughs> and then, after that, I would like you all to get liquored up, and then... <laughs> No, that's not true. We're just going to play a few songs here for you. We've actually uh, got some new songs we've been working on, so we're going to use you as a sounding board for a couple of new songs. But before we do that, uh, uh, folks, I want to say, how many folks are here uh, for the first time at the Orange Blossom Opera? Your very first time here, okay? All right, really good. Where you been? Hey, we sell our old sweaty T-shirts that we used usually over here, but they're cleared off. Yeah, they're all gone out. They're all gone out. Um, you want tell them why? I sold my shirt. I don't even have a shirt on. Underneath. Bless his heart. Bless my heart. Uh, anyway, let's take a second. I want to introduce the band before we get too far, and then uh, we're going to play a little music for you. Uh, let's, uh, well, let's start. We always start with you, right? Yeah. The gentleman here we'll start uh, on with my the best. Left. Yeah, that's right. Uh, for you new folks, uh, the guy right there, standing, he, he doesn't look like much, but let me, uh, <laughs> let me just tell you about this guy. Uh, this guy is the hardest working guy uh, in the Orange Blossom Opry organization because uh, he's one of the first guys here in the morning and one of the last guys to leave. He is the road manager, stage manager, tour manager, bus driver, and uh, he also sings a fine song, plays the bass guitar, guitar, drums. Say hello to our pal. That's Kevin Kingston, everybody. Hey. Oh, he's clapping. Hey. Oh, oh, you know him? Yeah. Oh, you don't? Hey, just go to the post office. You, you, he's, <laughs> you should see him. Yeah. The uh, gentleman way over there uh, on the left is the uh, only Floridian in the band. He's uh, from Florida. Yep, he sure is. And, uh, and he is, uh, stand up so they can see how handsome you are. He is the handsome and extremely talented. Say hello to our drummer, that's Todd Bowers. Oh, Todd me. Todd. Uh, the gentleman seated right here is uh, quite possibly, what happened? Uh, quite possibly one of the most talented guys I've had the privilege in my lifetime to, to share the stage with uh, because he plays all kinds of instrument, instruments. And uh, what makes me sick about the guy is he plays them all incredible. And uh, you locals that come here all the time know what to do. Do it loud on three. One, two, three. Hey! Woo! Hey, Dougie. That's Doug Stock, everybody. <clears throat> they say don't talk over your applause. So Especially there's... <clears throat> 
Yeah, especially over yours. <laughs> I don't get much, so I'll talk over yours. Uh, the you know, newest member of the Orange Blossom Opry Band uh, came here. How about that? Came here from, how about that? Because he's not from there. I like to refer to him. I call him cowboy sometimes. But he came here from Bandera, Texas. Uh, he's an also an extremely talented uh, guy. He plays the, the pedal steel and uh, sings a fine song and plays the guitar. And everybody say hello to our pal Mickey Adams. The gentleman standing next to me, all these handsome guys up here, you know, it's it just, they all make me, he's the pretty boy. He's, he's so cute, just so pretty. I just like to slap that guy. Uh, he comes from Nashville, Tennessee, ladies and gentlemen. I'll tell you something. You will go, I've been doing this, I've never done anything my whole life except play music. Never had another job. Played music from seventh grade till right now. Seventh grade wasn't that long ago. But uh, he's probably one of the finest singers you'll ever hear. Please say hello to Dustin Jenkins. Real quick, right down this aisle, folks, is the sixth member. Yeah, I don't know why. I get, that's kind of how he came in here. But he's uh, probably one of the most talented guys that I know as well. He makes us sound good here in the auditorium. He'll be running sound for the uh, other band as well. He's uh, twice Grammy nominated for his work with Dolly Parton. Uh, he's our pal. He's our friend. He's our sound engineer. Everybody say hello to Nathan Smith back there. <laughs> and ladies and gentlemen, from Bum Squat, Idaho. That's from Idaho this week. Idaho, that's right. Uh, he said one time that his girlfriend, I said, what's your girlfriend? He, he, she was in a beauty uh, pageant, and he, it said right on the front of it, Idaho. And I, I never wanted to ask him what that meant. We're going to get letters on that one. <laughs> that's what her name was, Ida. Address, Idaho. Those, address those letters to Bobby Randall, please. First name was Ida. Say hello to our buddy Tom up there. He does all the video work, everybody. Don't send me any letters because I don't read them anyway. <laughs> I only, only, only letters I get are the bad ones. The boss comes back and goes, well, you got another one, Randall. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, our talented uh, gentleman up there behind the lights is responsible for all of the lights up here on the show. Uh, I know some of you have been coming here for 15, 20 years, and all of this new business is all uh, because of one guy back there. And uh, as you can see, you can see him up there. Once he was a solid gold dancer. Um, <laughs> his name used to be Edith. But now it's a uh, say hello. There he is. That's when he was Edith. Uh, no, say hello to our pal uh, Fast Eddie up there. All right, we'll move along. And my name's Bobby Randall, and we're gonna play some music for you. Well, you got my number, and you. My name, so why don't you call me Little Liza Jane? Oh. Now you've got that body, and you've got that frame, yes, you do. So why?
more go on the solo. We didn't hear Bobby play. Come on, Bobby. like that kind of music. Well, we want to tell you about something very special going on here. How many of you like Mr. Vince Gill? Music by Vince Gill. Let me hear it. Well, unfortunately, he is not here tonight. Nor, nor, nor. <laughs> but we are having a special show. If you like Vince Gill music, March 26th right here at the Orange Blossom Opry, 7 p.m. Tickets are on sale right now. For uh, the boys in the band and me are going to put on a show called The Salute to the Music of Vince Gill. And so those tickets are selling fast. They're more than half gone now. So uh, still got a little time to get them. They're out available in the box office. So when we take intermission here in just a little bit before we get on with the main show, if you'd like to get a, a couple of tickets, um, my, my refrigerator would thank you. Yeah. And just make sure you grab a hold of those tickets before they're all gone. Uh, let's slow it down just a little bit. We're gonna do. Can we do a brand new song for you? They said no, Bobby. Yeah. Here's what we're doing. We, we're trying out a couple of new songs, folks, and so we're using you as a sounding board. If we get done, this is a, a, what the second time we've done this song. We did in, it last in, time. In in uh, two days. Yeah, second time we've done this song. And listen, if you folks don't like it, just tell us at the end of the song. We'll fire Dustin and we'll uh, throw. Touch me. I can feel how much you love me And it just blows me away I've never been this close to anyone or anything I can hear your thoughts I can see your dream I don't know why you do what you so in love with you, it just keeps getting better. I want to spend the rest of my life with you by my side forever and ever. Every little thing that you do, baby, I'm amazed. I want 
that boy could sing. How come, how come I have to sing after that? Because <laughs> I made up the set list. Oh, I see. That's, that's how it's going. Well, I'm going to need your help then. Are you, can you snap your fingers? Some people say man is made out of mud. A poor man's made out of muscle and blood. Muscle and blood and skin and bones A mind that's weak but a back that's strong You load 16 tons What do you get? Another day older, deeper in debt Same fear, don't you take me Cause I can't go I owe my soul to the company store sun didn't shine. I picked up a shovel and I walked to the mine. I loaded 16 tons of number nine ore and the straw boss said, well, bless my soul. I loaded 16 tons. What do you get? Another day older, deeper in debt. St. Peter, don't you call me cause I can't go. I owe my soul to the company store. Bobby Randall. Dustin Jenkins. Better stay. 
never sighed. A lot of men did and a lot of men died. One just of iron and the other is steel. If the right one don't get you, then the left one will. You load 16 tons. What do you get? Another day older and deeper in debt. St. Peter, don't you take me because I can't go. company store hey folks I don't know what you're doing tomorrow but I'm available for lunch I, I mean I, I planned on being here we're going to be here all day tomorrow, and uh, a bunch of buddies of mine are coming in tomorrow, and you need to come see them if you're not. You got people coming from the nursing home? Yeah, I do. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> That's awesome. Well, I'm on my way there. I won't be long, folks. Just uh, what they're doing is blazing a trail for me. But uh, there's a great band going to be here tomorrow, and we thought we'd play one of their songs. And so if you said, boy, I like those guys on the break, maybe you'd buy a couple of tickets. If not, yeah, I told oh, yeah, we're going to. Did you bet on this? Uh-oh. What happens is we always put up a set list, and we put X amount of songs on the set list. And then what we do is if we get out here and I talk too much or we get too long, I dump a song. And I usually dump one of my songs. So I dump my song. But those guys gamble on, on whether I'm going to sing that song or not. I'm in on this one, guys. Yeah, you are. But then I sang it last night, and it cost somebody 50 bucks. Uh, what, you okay, Dougie? You need a pick? That's in your teeth. <laughs> Nathan, I'm going to put this in the fiddle channel. Warning. Oh, hold on a minute. Why? He can't. I just love old people. Yeah. Don't try this at home, folks, because as you can tell, we are all pros here. Here's a song I wrote um, called uh, Tuning. Hey, you want to hear a song I wrote when I was in jail? Can I play no. a song when I was in jail? Listen yeah. to this. this I'm one back my... in the banjo. Wait, let me get in tune first. You know, I used to be in gospel music, and this reminds me of working with Bill Gaither. Yeah. So here's a song I here, here's a song I wrote when I was in jail. Now picture me in jail, and then here's a song. All I have is. Ah, yeah. <laughs> oh, that one there makes me cry. That was a good one. One of the saddest songs I ever wrote. Y'all ready? A big red goodbye and lipstick on the wall. Goodbye says it all. No long explanation, no reconciliation, no let's talk it over number I can call. Goodbye says it all. A goodbye. words on me and all she kept it short and sweet she left me no chance at redemption no further exemption just a big red goodbye and lipstick on the wall goodbye says it all and no long explanation Talk it over number I can call. Goodbye.
Everybody, Blackhawk will be here tomorrow. Yes, Some sir. of y'all just look shocked. Uh, here's Mickey with a song that's more of the era of what we're doing. I'm gonna play this guitar, Mickey. Yes, sir. All right. I can hear you. Long distance information, give me Memphis, Tennessee. Help me reach the parties, trying to get in touch with me. She could not leave her number, I know she's the one to call. Uncle took the message and he wrote it on the wall. Long distance information, get in touch with my Marie. She's the only girl who call me here from Memphis, Tennessee. The phone is on the south side, high up on a ridge. It's just a half a mile from that Mississippi bridge. Come on, Doug. Because her mom did not agree She tore apart our happy home there in Memphis, Tennessee Come on, Dustin! Thank you. Hey, I got a couple of announcements to make here while we uh, prepare for our last uh, song. Uh, let's see, not this coming Wednesday, or it is this coming Wednesday, uh, the band Exile will be here. And uh, they were supposed to be here a couple Saturdays ago, and somebody uh, got the yes. old got the old COVID. Uh, is that it's this uh, Tuesday? It's a uh, 
No, it's 23rd. It's the next week. It's yeah. the next week. Well, 23rd, 29th, whatever. <laughs> it's uh, okay, Papa. It's okay. <laughs> uh, yeah. So they'll be here. But I also need to tell you this. I believe that you know, Roger, uh, not that Roger, my boss Roger, always asks me to make all these announcements. I'm the worst guy to make announcements. I can't remember my own name most of the time. And he said, well, tell them this date, tell them that date. And I said, Pfft. But um, there's a band coming uh, called Hotel California, if you're a, a fan of the Eagles. And uh, they were on a, a Tuesday and Wednesday night, and now uh, tickets will be on sale on the break for Thursday night because both shows have sold out on Tuesday and Wednesday, and I believe that's the uh, last week uh, in March, somewhere in there, whatever that says up there. March 29th, 30th, and I guess that would be uh, the 31st. Uh, there's, there's 31 days in March, I believe. So, uh, see, I'm a lot smarter than I look. I uh, think there's 31 days. I believe there March, is. Yeah. Anyway, yeah, just show up sometime uh, in March. <laughs> But check that out. And the best thing to do is, is to go to our website um, and check that out. I don't know if it's on there, but just go to What is anyway. our website? Uh, our website is uh, www.orangeblossomopry.com. OB Opry. OB Opry. Really? Yeah. I, I'm surprised they even know that. <laughs> but at any rate, are you all having a good time so far? Everything okay? All right. And we want to tell you on Thursday night, for some of you folks that are just new, on Thursday night we have what's called a showcase. And if you're a singer and you're interested in coming up here and playing with the band, that's what happens on Thursday nights. And if you're interested in that, just talk to somebody around here. They'll tell you how to get in touch with uh, the right guy. Neil is who you need to talk to. will tell you how to get on that show. We'd love to have you on the show. We told you we've been working on another song, and uh, this may not be the audience uh, for this song. Uh, do we have any 50 Cent uh, folks in here at all? Because we've been practicing the 50 Cent song. I'm surprised you even know who 50 Cent is, Roger. I'm so disappointed in you. <laughs> Anyway, uh, no, you probably won't know this song, but it's a song we've been working on and uh, because we want to play it well. Uh, we don't get any time to rehearse, and uh, all we do is just kind of wing it, so we're kind of winging this. This will be the uh, second time we played this song, too. Is that correct? Yeah, because we played it last night, did we not? So this will be the second time we played this song, and uh, if you like it, let us know. If you don't, again, we'll just fire Dougie. <laughs>
69 And still those voices are calling from far away Wake you up in the middle of the night Just to hear them say Welcome to the hotel Such a lovely place on the 12-string, everybody. Mickey Adams on the guitar. Dustin Jenkins, Todd Bowers, and Kevin Kingston. I'm Bobby Randall. We're the Orange Blossom Opry Band. God bless you all. Thank you so much. Good night. We'll see you in a little bit. 15-minute break. We'll be right back. One more time, folks, for the Orange Blossom Opry Band.
get out of the lobby because I don't want them to start playing when people are walking in. And so we'll, uh, we'll tell those folks to hurry up. This old couple's walking down the beach, and a genie comes up and says, uh, hey, I'll grant you both uh, one wish. And so she uh, points at the lady <clears throat> and says, well, what about you, ma'am? And she said, I want to be filthy rich. I want to have so much money I never have to worry about money again. More money than ever before. Wouldn't that be a woman's wish? Yeah. So this genie goes and hands her a credit card and said, here's a debit card that will never run out of money, ever. You can buy houses, cars, yachts, take trips around the world, buy anything. It will never, ever run out of money. You're set. So it looks at the guy and says, how about you, sir? And he said, well, you know, he said, uh, I've always wanted to have a wife 40 years younger than me. So the genie goes, just like that, he was 90 years old. <laughs> all right. All right, all right. Okay, a couple things uh, real quick, uh, and, and you can boo me if you want. But they, uh, they make the announcement at the top of the show, and then they make me come out here and say this. But... Um, we really uh, wish you wouldn't uh, walk with chocolate ice cream. They should just give it to me because you're not going to eat all that. Uh, they are uh, <clears throat> they say no videotaping, so please don't do that, okay? Because if they catch you doing video, they're going to ask you to leave, and we don't want to do that. So please, no video stuff. Ready? Boo. Go ahead. All right. All right. Anyway, uh, I'm excited about this because I was on American Bandstand. There I am with Dick Clark. Yeah, right there. How about that? Yeah, yeah, with nice pants, right? Whatever. Anyway, uh, so I'm going to uh, turn it back over to Neil Bogus. And uh, first, on behalf of everybody here, meaning our band, the staff, the management, everybody, God bless you all for supporting live music and supporting the Orange Blossom Opry. I mean it. Thank you all so very much. That comes from the owners, Roger and Heather, all the way down through the band and all the way down to even the people who clean the toilets. And speaking of that, I'd like to introduce you to the main cleaner here. There you go. <laughs> I'm always just a flush away there, Bobby. <laughs> if you wondered what band that was that we saw him in, that was a little group called Sawyer Brown. He was one of the founding fathers of that band. So then he moved on to a band called uh, Confederate Railroad. And he played with people my generation, like Leroy Van Dyke, Charlie Rich, and somebody named Kenny Rogers. So it's great to have you with us. I want to tell you before we get this show started tonight about my friend Ron. And I wrote so much down, I have to kind of read it for you. Ron has a career of over 50 years in this business. He developed a love for radio. At the age of 11, he built his own radio station. He got his first commercial DJ job at the age of 14. In 1972, he began his singing career. He was nominated for two Grammy Awards during that time. He has owned radio stations. On December 1990, he began his own show, The Ron Seggy Show, live from Universal Studios here in Florida. On Ed McMahon's Next Big Star, guess who was the announcer for that? Ron Seggy. Ron Seggy Stowe is still being broadcast, and I'm proud to call him a friend, Ron Seggi is a nice guy, very talented, and a real legend in his own time. On July 9, 1956, a young, unknown radio disc jockey by the name of Dick Clark took over the reins of a local Philadelphia television show called Bandstand. One year later, that same show's name was changed to American Bandstand, and on August 5, 1957, the program debuted nationally on the ABC television network. The American Bandstand was on the air for a remarkable 32 consecutive years. The rock and roll era came of age with the help of the American Bandstand and its eternally young host, Dick Clark. A singer would be guaranteed stardom and big record sales if they appeared on the show. And Dick's smooth demeanor even attracted an older audience than teenagers because the parents felt that their children were in good hands with the show and its host. Now we want to take you back to the early days of American Bandstand. And as my friend Dick Clark would say, with the music that is the blueprint of our lives. I would like to dedicate tonight's concert 
to my two longtime friends and broadcasting legends, Dick Clark and my show business and broadcasting partner, Ed McMahon. This is Ed McMahon, and now, ladies and gentlemen, here's Ronnie! Swing with the crowd and we'll be floating, floating high in the cloud. The kids are dancing, my mom and dad are so proud. We're on bandstand. And we'll jump and hey and might even do a bandstand. Because we are, we are, we are on the American bandstand. And we'll dance real slow and show all the guys in the grandstand. So that I am, I am, I am on the American bandstand. We're going off and we're going hopping today, the things are bombing, the Philadelphia way, we're going to drop it, and all the music we play, we're on bandstand. Well, as long as I'm singing, there's a bell up in my head, keeps ringing, making a crazy ding dong. And if this band don't desert me, well, there's nothing in the world that can hurt me. Long as we're singing my song, just give me trumpets, licato, and add these saxes to them. Strings, pizzicato, and add some rhythm as long as I'm singing. Oh, the world's all right and everything's swinging. Long as I'm singing our songs, go get them, gentlemen. Oh, the world's all right and everything's swinging Long as I'm singing our song And if this band don't desert me Well, there's nothing in the world that could hurt me Long as I'm singing our song Just give me trumpets, legato And add these saxes to them Strange pizzicato And add some rhythm as long as I'm singing Oh, the world's all right and everything's swinging. Long as I'm singing our, long as I'm singing our, long as I'm singing our. Thank you. 
you very much. Boy, Friday night with a Saturday night crowd. I can see this coming. Well, we have a goal we're going to try to do tonight, and that's bring you back a few years when gasoline was cheap, McDonald's was still changed from a dollar. We're going to take you to an easier time, a time when you didn't have to worry about mortgage and the IRAs and everything else. I mean, you're sitting here having a great time. We don't want you to think about how your grandchildren are probably stealing all your money at this point. We want to take you back to a better time, okay? So just forget about all the woes and the worries of being a little older. And let's think about being young. In fact, if you want to, you can hold that woman's hand. Okay. It doesn't look like she wants you to, but do it anyway, okay? You know, Dick Clark was a great guy and a dear friend of mine. And I was sitting in his office one day and I said, Dick, did you ever have something that didn't strike gold. And he said, what do you mean? I said, well, you know, everything you, you touched turned to gold. And he said, well, there was one instance when I really kind of blew it. I said, what happened there? He said, some young singer came in and he said, I want to do this song. This was like 1959. And Dick said, if you do that song, your career will be over in a heartbeat. You can't do that. You're a pop singer. You need to do some rock and roll. You need to do some stuff. Well, the singer didn't listen to him, and he went on to record the song. And I want to tell you something. The song not only was number one one year, but it was number one two years in a row. And the song goes like this. There's no words to the song. We just do this. How do you like it so far? I love the lyrics. Oh, the shark, baby. Has such teeth, dear, and he shows them pearly white. Just a jackknife has old Mac Keith, babe, and he keeps it out of sight. You know when that shark bites with its teeth, babe, scarlet below. Start to spread And the fancy gloves Where's Where's old Mackie Babe So there's never no Never no trace of red Now down on a sidewalk One sunny morning Don't you know There lies a body Just a oozing line I got someone Sneaking around the corner Could that someone be our boy Mac the Knight? Now there's a tugboat down, down, down by the river, don't you know? Oh, where's a man that's just losing on down? And you know the a man is just, it's a there for wait. And five will get you ten, twenty, thirty, Max back in town. Now did you hear about Louis Miller? He disappeared, babe. Won't have to draw it out. All of his hard-earned cash. And now Mac keeps spent just like a sailor. Could it be our boy? That's something rad.
we have, uh, well, you're a great audience. I see we're going to have a good time tonight. There's no doubt about that. But there, uh, there's uh, uh, some people in the audience tonight that I, I want to recognize, and that is the married couples. Okay. If you are married, by a round of applause, please clap. If you are happily married, please clap. Why, why do I sense there is a little doubt in your mind? <laughs> why, do, why do I sense that? <laughs> you like Neil Diamond? Oh, we don't know any Neil Diamond songs. I'm sorry. Let's do a Neil Diamond song. Where it began, well, I can't begin to know it, but then I know it's growing strong. It was in the spring, and spring became the summer. Who'd have believed you'd come along? Hand, touching hand. Reaching out, touching me, touching you. Sweet Caroline, the good times never seem so good. Oh, yeah, yeah, I've been inclined to believe they never would, but now I look at the night. so lonely we fill it up with only two and when I hurt the burden runs off my shoulders how can I hurt when holding you warm touching warm reaching out Touching me, touching you, sweet Caroline, the good times never seem so good, oh, I've been inclined to believe you never would, but now. You're great. You know, I failed to do something tonight, and I apologize for that, especially in the fact that I think we have the biggest fan of Tony Orlando in the audience tonight. But uh, I failed to be able to include this song in the show, but I have to tell the story. Okay, so just pretend we did knock three times. It was great arrangement. You'd have loved it. Come back tomorrow. We'll do it. But Tony was on the, dear friend of mine, was on American Bandstand show, and he was doing one of his early songs, and the whole time, that he was doing it, he looked over, because they pantomimed at that time, he looked over and Dick Clark was monkeying with his belt. And it kind of threw Tony off a little bit. And what happened was he, uh, he told Dick after the show, he says, you know, I don't know what the problem was, but you kept on monkeying around with your belt. He said, w it was very distracting, what was wrong? And he says, well, Tony, your zipper was down the whole time. 
So what are you going to do? Going to do it? Sure. Okay, we're going to do it. We're going to do Knock Three Tides. Okay? Do you like that song? You'd rather hear Yellow Ribbon, You Don't Know Me Like I Love You, or something of that nature. While they're doing that, let me just make mention of the fact that the area that we're in right now, and I look at all the great, great, great faces here tonight, and I think to myself, class reunions. You've been to a class reunion, haven't you? I won't ask you what it was, because I can't count that high, but do you ever go to a class reunion? I got one coming up next month, and somebody comes up to you and says, geez, you look the same as what you did in high school. That's not a compliment. <laughs> that basically means you look like hell in high school. Okay, so when somebody does that, just make sure that you, <laughs> you be very conscientious of that. You want to try this? Okay, we're going to do knock three times in honor of my buddy Tony Orlando. on the bike if you're not gonna show if you look out your window tonight seeing a note attached to a string into my heart read how many times I saw you and in my dreams how I adored you one floor below me you don't even know me I love you Knock three times on the ceiling if you want me. Oh, twice on the bike if the answer is no. Oh, my sweetness, knock three times means you'll meet me in the hallway. Oh, twice on the bike means you're not gonna show. on the bike if the answer is no oh my darling just a knock three times on the ceiling if you want me oh and twice on the bike if you're not gonna show oh my darling just a knock three times on the ceiling if you want me is no means you'll meet me in the hallway twice on the pipe means you're not gonna show cha 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 thank you ah you're great we have any out of towners here tonight Everybody's from out of town. Nobody's from Florida. Where are you from, sir? You, you're from Florida? Really? You're, this is the couple that was born in Florida. I've always wanted to meet you. Where are you from, sir? Where's that? Florida. Now. Okay, what well, before? New York. Security. Security, New York. How about this couple over here? 
Detroit. Oh, wow. Detroit, that's my favorite town. Mine too, mine too. Where are you from, dear, with the uh, white boots on there? New York. <laughs> Out on the front row. How about over here? Where? That's my favorite town. <laughs> Don't get ahead of me now. There was a fella who had a great, great career. He wrote many songs for many artists, including uh, Bobby V and uh, Ricky Nelson. And, you know, a lot of people knew, they wouldn't recognize his name, but they knew all of his songs. And we'd like to do one of them for you right now. Great, great singer. Great song by Gene Pippin. Isn't that my girl? And is that my best friend? Aren't they walking much too? Close together and it don't look like They're talking about the weather I must be seeing things I thought I'd never see I must be hearing things When I hear her say to him I want you, I need you, I love you Looking through a tear I can see him kissing her And I feel my poor heart slowly breaking I'd give anything if only I were mistaken I must be seeing things I thought I'd never see I must be hearing things when I hear him say to her thought I'd never see I must be hearing things You made a fool out of me I must be seeing things And hearing things Oh no is a song that I recorded and I recorded it on my honeymoon didn't go over really big you know but we recorded on our honeymoon we did it with the same orchestra that uh, Maureen McGovern did the morning after the, from the Poseidon adventure and it did very well in fact the very first day it was out on the shelves it sold 32,364 copies the reason I know that is they're all in my garage. <laughs> I gotta do something with these things, really. Anyways, it's called If You Gave Me a Penny, and it goes like this. It's got a little Chicago taste to it. Come on. Come on. Give me a penny. Come on now. Give me a penny If you gave me a penny for my deepest thoughts You wouldn't find many Cause I feel so lost without you And if you gave me a penny for my sweetest dreams You wouldn't find many happy loving schemes Without you My thoughts and dreams are not worth much confusion reigns inside save your penny someone you touch who needs more than i play gentlemen For my saddest tears You find I cry plenty It's my new career Without you And if 
if you gave me a penny for a funny joke You wouldn't find many Cause I've lost all hope Without you My thoughts and dreams Are not worth much Confusion reigns inside Save your penny Someone you touch May need them more than I Thank you so much. Thank you. That's very nice. Anybody, anybody here celebrating a birthday tonight? There's got to be somebody selling a birthday birthday. Nobody has a birthday in this room. When? Sunday. So, it's your birthday it's this Sunday. <laughs> you should, you shouldn't be so excited about it. Uh, may I ask how? Oh, oh, it's not you. Is it you? It's your birthday. Wait a minute, I'm all confused here. Where, the girl next to you? <laughs> I feel like I'm on Ancestry.com. <laughs> A sister by another mother. Do you know who the mother is? Better yet, do you know who the father is? So how, how may I ask how old you're gonna be? How old you're going to be? Older? <laughs> okay. Well, you know what? We we always like to sing Happy Birthday, but I um, what? Excuse me. All right. My sax player over here claims. What is your name? Does she? Are you a ventriloquist? Can she talk? <laughs> Let me, let me hear her say something, just for the hell of it. You just wave? Oh, you're drunk, okay. <laughs> Nobody explained that. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. Whew, man. I could have been selling storm windows tonight, you know that? Wow. Okay, well, anyway, my saxophone player, and I've never seen this done before, claims he can play Happy Birthday backwards. So we got to see this, all right? You sure? Okay, all right. What is your name, seriously? What is it? Margie? Pat and Margie. God, why did I pick on those two? <laughs> anyway, so you can play this happy birthday backwards, all right, for Patty, Margie, and the whole Ma Mormon Tabernacle Choir back there. Go ahead. Yeah, go try it now. Oh. All right, Randy, 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 Randy. S sit down, sit down. You actually deserve that. <laughs> you know that, don't you? There was a singer that had more soul in his baby finger than most of us have in our entire body. And it wasn't Margie who did this. His name was Ray Charles, and we'd like to do one of his songs. Ooh, you don't know me. Ooh, you don't love me. You give your hand to me. Then I say hello. And I can hardly speak My heart is beating so Oh, anyone could tell You think you know me well But you don't know me No, you don't know me No, you don't know the one Who dreams of you at night 
And longs to kiss your lips And longs to hold you tight Oh, I am just a friend That's all I've ever been You don't know me For I never knew the art of making love Though my heart aches with love for you Afraid and shy, well I let my chance go by A chance that you might have loved me too You gave your Then you say goodbye And I watch you walk away Beside that lucky guy No, no, to never know The one who loves you so No, you don't know me That you might have loved me too You give your hand to me And then you say goodbye And I watch you walk away Beside that lucky guy No, no, you'll never know How much I love you so Cause you don't Know me. You don't love me. You don't know me. Thank you so much. Thank you. Aren't they great? Well, you remember Dick Clark used to go over to this board. And he always have, you know, like 10 of the top 10 tunes. You saw that on the video. We only have three uh, low-budget show here. <laughs> but if we do real well and you come back next week, we might be able to get the other seven. That's what we're working on. But he used to come up here and he'd say, this song this week is number, and he'd pull it, right? So this song this week is number three. <laughs> As I walked along, I wondered oh, what went wrong with our love, a love that was so strong. And as I still walked on, I think of the things we've done together while our hearts were young. Now I'm walking in the rain.
Now we know what kind of audience you are. Got a lot of smiles in here. Huh? Just can't move that quick anymore, right? But they're in your mind, it's, it's great. We're going to go back to the board here. This is almost sacrilegious to do the song by this guy, but we're going to give it a shot, all right? All was all right for a while. I could smile for a while. But then I saw you last night. You held my hand so tight as you stopped to say hello. Oh, you wish me well. You couldn't tell. That I'd been crying over you, crying over you, and now that you're gone and left me standing all alone, alone and crying, crying, crying. Crying, it's hard to understand how the touch of your hand will start me crying. I thought that I was over you, but it's true, oh so true. I love you even more than I did before. But darling, what can I do? For you don't love me. And I'll always be crying over. Good night, I'm leaving. No, no, keep going. Keep going. Go. Now you got the hang of it. Pretty woman for walking down the street. Pretty woman, the kind I like to meet. Pretty woman. You're not the truth. No one could look as good as you. Mercy. Pretty woman, oh, won't you pardon me? Pretty woman, I couldn't help but see. Pretty woman, wow, look at them all. Oh, you're as lovely as can be. Like me, holy man. What beautiful girl.
make me cry, pretty woman. Don't walk away. Okay. If that's the way it must be, okay. I guess I'll go on home. It's late. Maybe tomorrow night. But wait, what do I see? Give a big hand of applause for this group over here. Are you kidding? You want to come to the next show with us? A lot of fun on the bus. We need to get a bus. <laughs> we don't have a bus. We need a bus. A good friend, and I hate to be a name dropper, but in this particular case, I'll just waddle through it. And that is Bill Medley of the Righteous Brothers. One, one time, I was in the audience in Branson, and he was up there talking about the fact that up to a certain point, the number one song that got the most airplay on commercial radio stations was Yesterday by the Beatles. And he was so excited over the fact that his song took over that spot, and he thanked me because he knew I was in the radio business. So hence the reason why we want to play this song. You never close your eyes anymore when I kiss your lips And there's no tenderness like before in your fingertips You're trying hard not to show it But baby love and feeling oh that love and feeling you lost that love and feeling now it's gone 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 no 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 now there's no tenderness in your arms when I reach out to you Girl, you're starting to criticize every little thing that I do. You know I just feel like crying. Because baby, something beautiful crying. You've lost that love and feeling. Oh, that love and feeling. You've lost that love and feeling, now it's gone, 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 no, 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 no. Baby, baby, I get down on my knees for you. How much I love you, just how much I love you, sweet baby. If you would only love me like you used to do. How much I love you, just how much Love you don't find every day. No, no, you won't find it every day. But don't, 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 don't give don't, it away. Don't. Listen to me talking to you. You've lost that love and feeling. Oh, that love and feeling. And you've lost that love and feeling. Now it's gone. Gone, gone, well, but I can't go on. No, 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 no,
Thank you so much. You know, I mentioned before about being in the radio business, which I still am, by the way, as a national syndicated radio show. But when I first started in the business, as Neil was so kind to point out, I was only 14 years old. And when you work late night at a radio station, at a rock and roll station, you get a lot of phone calls at night. And they're usually from girls. And these girls have, like, sensational voices, okay? And they used to call me up and they say, Ronnie? And I said, yes, what are you doing when you get off the air tonight? I didn't want to tell them that my mother was going to pick me up at the radio station. <laughs> Just not cool, you know? I mean, yeah, I can, but do uh, you mind if my mom comes with you, you know? When I turned 16 and got my license, the first girl called me up. She said, Ronnie, what are you doing when you get off? And I said, why? She said, if you come over here, nobody's home. So I went over there. And nobody was home. <laughs> Very strange. <laughs> you think that's a joke? <laughs> but it really happened. And they all had great voices, too. Let's play a song for the Elvis fans out there right now, OK? We're caught in a trap. I can't walk out. Because I love you too much, baby yeah. Oh, why can't you see oh, 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 what you're doing to me When you don't believe the word I'm saying Just try to say hello Would you still see suspicion in my eyes? Here we go again Oh, asking where I've been Can't you see the tears are real, I'm going Just mine. And we can build our dreams on suspicious minds. Oh, let our love survive. I'll dry the tears from your eyes. Oh, just don't let a good thing die. No, no, because, honey, you know I never lie to you. Yeah, 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 We're caught in a trap I can't walk out Because I love you too much I'm gonna give it a try, okay? Well, why can't you see whoa, 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 What you're doing to me When you don't believe a word I'm saying don't you know I'm caught in a trap? Oh, I can't walk out because I love you too much, baby. But oh, don't you know I'm caught in a trap? I can't walk out because I love you too much, baby. But oh, don't you know I'm Caught in a trap, oh, I can't walk out Because I love you too much, baby Why oh, don't you know I'm caught in a trap, oh, I can't walk out Because I love you too much, baby Oh, man, you're a great audience. Now, you're really, I really appreciate 
This is a good group. Sold out crowd. Thank you so much. I'd like you to meet the members of our band who are up on stage, which I just idolize these men and women because they are terrific musicians. And I want to tell you, before we introduce them, I want to say that Bobby Randall and his crew here at the Orange Blossom Opry are excellent musicians, too. Are they not? Bobby, is that the way you wanted me to say that? Is that what you wanted me to say? He's going to pay me later? Okay. First of all, on trombone, I'm going to go way over here, is our great trombone player, Mike Lott. Mike? Next to Mike, guys have been maybe a long time. I love his name. Will Rogers, ladies and gentlemen. On trumpet, dapper, dapper, dapper. James Hall, ladies and gentlemen. Next to James, also a, a longtime member of the band, Brian Finnegan. Brian, take a bow, my friend. And next to him, this is the crazy guy of the band, but he has, he plays the drums, he plays the trumpet, he plays around. Uh, <laughs> that's a new one. Evan Shard. On lead guitar, Austin Rodriguez. Yeah. On bass guitar, his father, a, this is a business here, Herman Rodriguez. Don't they look alike? Don't they look alike? On baritone sax, Mike Sanford. On alto sax, Gary Dean. On tenor sax, and sometimes <laughs> out there, Rand Tool, ladies and gentlemen. And on keyboard from England, Kevin Wardle, ladies and gentlemen. I'll tell you something. These two girls are absolutely sensational. <laughs> Collector Thomas. And Tanya Staples. Are they not great? Even though Collector don't want to hold my hand. Want to try that again? Okay. She can't get her to warm up to me for some reason. I don't know what it is. Oh, and my arranger, the leader of the band, and the guy that puts it all together. Nice round of applause for Mr. Ted Innes. Ted, take a bow. He's in charge of this whole thing. They're going to do me a favor right now, and they're going to play a song that I, they do. We, did, we didn't play enough of this song. It's a great song. This song, by the way, the American Bandstand theme, was actually Dick Clark was not the eternal teenager. He, you know, he did age, but he came from an era where big bands were very popular, and that song was recorded by Les Elgard in its orchestra, which was a big band in the 40s. But uh, we're going to have the band play, but I got to tell you something. I'm very lucky to have found these gentlemen. I really am. I couldn't really figure out how I could find so many talented musicians in one geographical area like Central Florida. And then I found out that they're on a work release program. <laughs> That's their, and these are actually their garb that they wear when they go out. Ladies and gentlemen, with the American Bandstand theme, the Caravan of Stars Orchestra. <laughs>
just take those old records off the shelf I sit and listen to them by myself Today's music ain't got the same soul I like that old time rock and roll Don't try to get me to no disco You'll never even get me out on the floor In ten minutes I'll be straight for the door I take that old time rock and roll Just like that old time of rock and roll The kind of music just soothes the soul I reminisce about the days of old With that old time of rock and roll Just like that old time of rock and roll The kind of music just soothes my soul I reminisce about the days of old With that old time rock and roll Gonna tell Aunt Mary about Uncle John Said she got the blues but she's having plenty from the old baby John with Paul hit his alley. He saw Mary coming, but he jumped back in the alley. Oh, baby. 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 Oh, ba
And many people come and throw miles around. They see him play his music when the sun goes down. But maybe one day he'll end will be in light. Johnny be good tonight. Go, go, go. Go, Johnny, go, go. Go, Johnny, go, go, go. Go, Johnny, go, go, go. There you go. Go, Johnny, go, go. Take it home, Kevin. Johnny be good. Go, 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 go. Go, Johnny, go, go. Go, Johnny, go, go, go. Go, Johnny, go, go. Go, Johnny, go, go. Bring it on home, Kevin. Johnny be good. Thank you. Now, I just, I just want you to know that I know I've passed this microphone around, and I don't have COVID, OK? I have leprosy. So I just <laughs> Normally, at this stage of the game, this beautiful lady comes out, and she does a rendition of a song that you're going to love. And she dances around, and dances around, and just blows the back door off of every place that we play. Unfortunately, she broke her foot. Okay, so the next time we come back, you'll see her dance all around. But for now, she's gonna play it nice and easy. Nice and e easy. Ladies and gentlemen, the, you know, <laughs> you love all the sympathy, don't you? You just love it. You love it. Tanya Staples, ladies and gentlemen. Y'all having a good time? Let's keep the party going. Y'all ready? You know, every now and then, I think you might like to hear something from us. Nice. And easy. But you see, there's just one thing. We never, ever do nothing nice and easy. We always do it nice and rough. But we're going to take the beginning of this song, guys. We're going to do it for you nice and easy. And then we're going to finish it out. And we're going to do it for you. Nice and rough. Because that's the way we do. Proud Mary. And we roll. Rolling. Rolling down a river. Listen to the story. Left a good job out in the city. Working for the man every night and day. But I never lost one minute of sleeping. Worried about the way that things might have been. The big wheel keep on turning. And the proud Perry keep on burning. And we're rolling. Rolling, yeah, rolling on a river. Cleaned a lot of plates in Memphis. You know I pumped a lot of tank down in New Orleans. But I never saw the good side of a city until I hitched a ride on the riverboat.
You can dance. I left a good job in the city, working for the man every night and day. But I never lost a man in a sleeping, worried about the way things might have been. Big wheel keep on turning, problems keep on burning. And we're rolling, rolling, rolling on the river. Say we're rolling, rolling, rolling. to see her when she's not limping. Well, we're going to pick things up a little bit now. <laughs> Frankie Valley had a great song that he used to do all the time on American Bandstand. And I always thought it was a fantastic arrangement until I watched Jersey Boys. And then I saw the arrangement they had on there. And that's the one we'd like to do for you right now. Can't take my eyes off of you You're just too good to be true You'd be like heaven to touch I want to hold you so much At long last, love is a lie and I thank God I'm alive You're just too good to be true Can't take my eyes off of you Pardon the way that I stare There's nothing else to compare The sight of you leaves me weak 
There are no words left to speak But if you feel like I feel Then you know it's for real You're just too good to be true Can't take my eyes off of you Take my eyes off of you You'd be like heaven to touch I want to hold you so much At long last the love has arrived And I thank God I'm alive You're just too good to be true Can't take my eyes off of you You're just too good to be true. Thank you very much. Hey, here, boy, I tell you, I don't, I'm going to take you all home with me tonight. What's the address in your house again, Ted? We'll take them to your house, okay? Because, hey, turn the house lights for a second, okay? Because we need some help from the audience right now. And believe me, believe me when I tell you this. You have to believe me. Okay, you don't have to, but it'd be a good shot if you did. That I'm not here to embarrass anyone. All right, no, I'm serious. I'm not here to embarrass not a single soul. I just need some help on stage, and I'm looking for. Who's this guy? You want you you want to do it, or you want him to do it? Oh, come on, come on. We're always looking for a pretty pretty girl. Wow, who do you know to get good seats back here? <laughs> Honey, this is not that kind of a show. Okay. <laughs> Just keep on what you got on. What is your name? Andy. 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 Okay. Andy. Yeah. A and uh, Andy I. See? Where's the people at the They left? Oh gosh. I got I got them safe. I just wanted to show that Andy knows how to spell her name and the other girl didn't even know what her name was. <laughs> Andy, I want you to go up on stage there. Okay? Look for a man here. A real man. <laughs> this looks like a, a some place that would. It's taking a long time to do this, you know that. <laughs> you want to, is that that man there? No, 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 no. I'm going to take you. Yeah, yeah. Now I tell you what, the guy that points is the guy that goes. Come on. It's the, it's the new game. The guy that points is the guy that goes. What's your name? Brian. Brian. What's your last name, Brian? Uh, Pearson. Where are you from? Oh, Italian fella. Yeah. Uh, where are you from? Uh, Detroit. Detroit. Oh, you know that guy over there? Uh, which the one over there from Detroit? Huh? Yeah. Okay. Andy, a don't talk to the musician. <laughs> <laughs> go, go on up, Andy. Yeah, you're going up. And we... <laughs> got a washer, <laughs> and we're going to pick on, you know what, you've been dancing around here for a while. Come on up, you come with me. Come on up. What is your name? Linda. Linda. 
the second time. Okay, Linda, you spell it with an I or a Y? Linda, Linda, you spell it with a Y or an I? I. I, okay. All right, so we got now, Andy, I want you to stand here, okay? Right here, Andy. No, here. No, here. No, here. Okay. Brian? Yes, sir. Brian? Uh, this is trouble, I know. This is going to be a problem. You stand there, and Linda, where are you from, Linda? From Florida. From Florida? Okay. Yeah. It's like charades. Where are you from? from oh, okay. You know, Andy, why don't you step down just a little bit more? Brian? Don't get too close to Andy. Okay. Okay. And Linda, over here. Now, I'm not uh, down over here. Okay. Over here. Over here. Okay. Over here. Over here. Is this your wife? No. No? You're single. I'm single. What are you doing tonight? Uh, <laughs> I get off the air at midnight. <laughs> okay. Uh, anyway, what are you laughing about, Brian? This is not that funny. <laughs> okay. Now, I want you guys to just kind of feel the music and do what you feel you can do when we do this song. Now, let all inhibitions leave you, okay? All right. Ready, gentlemen? Uh, come on, baby. Uh, let's do the twist. Hey, we got a good crew. Uh, come on, baby. Let's do the twist. You really know how to rock. You know how to twist. Keep going. Your daddy's just sleeping. And mama ain't around. Oh, Brian, family. Your daddy's just sleeping. And your mama ain't around. We're going to do this. Do we knock the house down? All right, stop it, stop it, stop it. What do you think of that? Stay where you are. What do you think of that? I think they did a heck of a job. Now, the real test. Now, I have a feeling, Brian, don't talk to the band. I have a feeling, here you go, Linda. Okay, you've never done this in your life? How old are you? Uh, younger than you. Younger. <laughs> Everybody's younger than me, Brian. Okay. I got to get a smart guy up here, right? Couldn't say, Mr. Sedgy, I wouldn't know about that. Andy, this is yours. Andy, you look like you're in shock. You're a majorette? What, you got this? You're not this? Well, I'm sorry, this is not multiple choice, Andy. <laughs> and you see, you go in the audience, we pick you out, we make a fool of you, you have no choice. Okay? All right, put, this goes around you. Not that way, this way. No, no, you can do it, Brian. Okay? Now let's try it again. Now don't hit each other, all right? Okay, okay put down, Andy. All right, let's go. Oh, come on, baby. Let's do the twist. Come on, baby, let's do the twist. You really know how to rock. You know how to twist. Hey, your mama just sleeping. Keep going. And your daddy ain't around. Oh, your daddy just sleeping. And your mama ain't around. Oh, gonna do the twist and twist. Do you knock the house down? That's great. Now, I'm going to give you a little help. Please. First of all, when was the stroke? <laughs> I don't know. 18? That's young to have a stroke. You know that? You think you're smart now. You're going to be an old man. <laughs> all right, now you hold this. I'll hold, I'll hold no, this. I'll this. No, no, you aren't going to do it. No. <laughs> hold that. Okay. No, I'll hold that. I'm so confused. No, no. I'll hold the whole... Hulu, okay? All right, uh, give, give, give him a little music here, okay? And I'll just, just give him a little, little twist. A little, little bit, okay? Ah, <laughs> uh, we're going to vote now, and I got to tell you, <laughs> I get this over with, okay? Now, the winner will get my latest CD. The loser will get two. <laughs> and I think you're going to get two, Brian. <laughs> I hope you like this kind of music at being... Give it to your friend from... He's over there. Okay. How about Linda? How do you think about Linda here? 
What about Brian? Yeah, not bad, Brian. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I did. What about Andy? She used to be a drum major. Well, I'll tell you what. I'm going to give one to all of you, okay? That's eight, that's eight dollars. Thank God I didn't get two. That's all right. You didn't get two. Let's give them all a nice round of applause. Andy. Uh, yeah, there you go. Brian, Linda, and Andy. Let's give them a nice round of applause. Thanks, guys. That was fun. We're done. He wants to know if we're done. Okay. If you ever do this for a living, don't pick on Brian. Okay. A couple of weeks ago, a buddy of mine was performing here. I've known him for a long, long time, uh, Mickey Gilly. And uh, so we thought we'd do, because we're at the great Orange Blossom Opry, a song that, uh, that Mickey probably sang here a couple of weeks ago. A little, little jive music here for us. Kevin? Closing time. They all begin to look like movie stars. Oh, yeah, now the girls all get prettier at closing time. When the change starts taking place, and there's a glow on every face, a fallen angel of a backstreet boy. If I could rate them on a scale from one to ten. I'm looking for a nine, but eight could work right in. A few more choices, and I might fall for a five or even four. But when tomorrow morning comes, and I wake up with number one, I swear I'll never do it anymore. That's why now the girls all get prettier at closing time. Sing it with me. They all begin to look like movie stars. Oh, yeah, now the girls all get prettier at closing time. When the change starts taking place, and there's a glow on every face, a fallen angel of a backstreet bar. Play it there, Kevin. I know Neil back is even over home. We all picture in our mind a girl that's just right. But when tomorrow morning comes and I wake up with number one, I swear I'll never do this anymore. That's why the girls all get prettier at closing time. They all begin to look like movie stars. Oh, yeah, now the girls all get prettier at closing time. When the change starts taking place, uh -huh. and there's a glow on every face, uh -huh. a fallen angel of a backstreet boy. Uh -huh. Oh, fallen angel of a backstreet boy. Uh -huh. Becky Gilly. I, uh, thank you. It's a fun song. I just found out that we're streaming this show live tonight, and uh, we're getting a lot of a lot of reaction online. So I'm very happy to hear that. But I got to tell you something: we've waited about four or five years to come here, and because we wanted to be here very, very bad. And so I, I want to thank some people that made this possible. First of all, I want to thank Roger and Heather Byers who have this fine establishment. Thank you, Roger. Thank you, Heather. We appreciate it. We hope we can come back. I mentioned Neil Backus. I want to thank Neil, Gary Keats, that's in watching in Nashville, Tennessee tonight, Stan Z, Steve McChesney, all the people that made it possible for us to be here, including this wonderful orchestra. I love this band, really. And you know, I'm going to be very honest with you. These people up here are friends. I mean, we just don't work together. They are friends. And I tell you, I'm just honored to have them here. And 
I want to say one other thing. Because I'm looking off to the right and I see somebody I, I know very well. And that is, you know, I know a lot of you have been married a long time. I have been married a long time. A very long time. And there's always a key to what keeps marriages a long time. You have to have something that you are interested in mutually. It could be music, it could be gardening, it could be travel, it could be bowling. In my case, we both love me, and it seems to have been working out very well. Claudia, come up here a second. Here. Claudia, come here. And this is my wife. This is my wife, Claudia. Okay, that's enough. That's way too much. Wise men say that only fools rush in, but I can. Falling in love with you. Wise men say, only fools, only fools rush in. But, but I, but I, I can't help falling in love with you. Shall I stay? Would it be, would it be a sin? For I can help falling in love with you. Like a river flows, surely to the sea, and darling, so it goes, some things are meant to be. Take my hand, take my whole life too, for I can help falling in love with you, for I can help falling in love with you. a good time? Okay. Well, I got to tell you something. This, this is a, a real treat for me, as I mentioned before, because you've been a great audience. Friday night's a tough night to come out. You come out, you're having a good time. Do we take you back a couple of years? Yes. Do you want to go back there? Do you want to go back there with what you know now? You don't want to go back there and know what you knew then, because you'd be just as screwy as you were when you were back there then. Starting to sound like Jackie Mason here for a second. <laughs> Every night I hope and pray a dream lover will come my way, a girl to hold in my arms and know the magic of her charms because I want a girl to call my arms. I don't have to dream alone. Sing it with me now. Dream lover, where are you? With a love that's so, so true. Thanks for coming. And a hand that I can hold to keep you near when I grow old. Because I want a girl. 
to call my own. I want to dream of it so I don't have to dream alone. Someday, I don't know how, I hope she'll hear my plea. Someday, I don't know how, she'll bring her love to me. Dream lover, until then, I'll go to sleep and dream again. That's the only thing to do with all my lover's dreams come true. Because I want a girl to call my own. I want a dream lover so I don't have to dream alone. Take it up a step now. Dream lover, where are you? With a love oh so true and a hand that I can hold to hold me near when I grow old because I want a girl to call my own I want a dream lover so I don't have to dream alone no 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 please don't make me dream alone oh no I don't want to dream alone no 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 Please don't make me dream alone, oh no. <laughs> Little Bobby Dare. I want to also recognize Nathan, our sound guy. He is absolutely outstanding. Outstanding. And Fast Eddie back there, who actually used to listen to me on radio up in Pennsylvania. That's how old Fast Eddie is. Brian. <laughs> and and the and the visual arts th this is just a great place great place now if we can have the house lights up just for one moment tom what is it tom 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 i thought that was god talking for us tom. tom 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 where's the video guy tom oh hey there you are tom <laughs> scared the hell out of me for a second What I'd like to do right now is have everybody who has ever served, are serving, or intend to serve in the United States Mar Army, Marines, all the military, please stand up. S stay standing. Also, I would like all of the first responders to stand up, all the first responders. So stay standing, okay, please. I, uh, I have a mantra that I, I like to talk about, and that is the two most important resources that we could have in this country are children and our military and our first responders. And without our military and first responders, our children will have no yesterdays, todays, or more importantly, no tomorrows. So for all of you men and women who have served Thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Thank you. Thank you. You have been a great audience, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much. I hope we can come back again soon. And uh, we'd like to dedicate this song not only to all of our military, but to all of us Americans. If tomorrow everything was gone I worked for all my life And I had to start again With just my children and my wife Well, I thank my lucky stars To be living here today Because the flag still stands for freedom And they can't take that away I'm proud to be an American Where at least I know I'm free And I won't forget Those who died Who gave that right to me And I gladly stand up Next to you And defend her still today Cause there ain't no doubt I love this land God bless 
the USA. From the lakes of Minnesota to the hills of Tennessee, all across the plains of Texas, from sea to shining sea, from New York down to Houston and L.A. to New York, there's a pride in every American's heart, and I'm here to stand and say that I'm proud of be an American, where at least I know I'm free, and I won't forget those who died who gave that right to me, and I gladly stand up next to you and defend her still today, cause there ain't no doubt I love this land, God bless the USA. Those who died who gave that right to me And I gladly stand up next to you And defend her still today Cause there ain't no doubt I love this land God bless the U.S.A. Those who died who gave that right to me And I gladly stand up next to you And defend her still today Cause there ain't no doubt I love this land God bless the U.S.A. Thank you so much. You can get our CDs over here, but thank you for coming. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, Ron Sete. We've got Ron Seed.